Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we have a fascinating historical journey ahead of us as we delve into the story of Bikram Shila University, one of the most illustrious centers of learning in ancient India and its tragic downfall. Bikram Shila University, situated on the banks of the river Ganga in present-day Bihar, India, was an epicenter of knowledge founded by King Dharmapal of the Pal dynasty in the late 8th century. This Buddhist institution attracted scholars, monks and students from across India and beyond. The academic excellence at Bikram Shila was unparalleled. It offered a comprehensive curriculum including Buddhist philosophy, Vedic studies, logic, grammar, medicine and more. Its library was a treasure trove of priceless manuscripts. Bikram Shila was not just a place of learning but also a breeding ground for eminent scholars. Figures like Uttis Dipankar who later played a vital role in the spread of Buddhism in Tibet were associated with the university. Famous Buddhist scholars like Manjushri and Dharmakirti were associated with Bikram Shila. Bikram Shila was one of the largest Buddhist universities of India with more than 100 teachers and about 1000 students. Distinguished Buddhist scholars of Bikram Shila were often invited by foreign countries to spread Buddhist learnings, culture and religion. However, the golden age of Bikram Shila was not to last. By the late 12th century, it faced repeated attacks by Muslim invaders. The university's vulnerability became evident, leading to its eventual downfall. In 1193 CE, Bikram Shila faced its darkest hours when Bakhtiyar Khilji, a general of Muhammad Ghari, invaded the university. His forces captured the institution, marked a tragic chapter in its history. The sacking of Bikram Shila resulted in the loss of countless priceless manuscripts and cultural heritage. Scholars and monks were either killed or forced to convert to Islam, and the university fell into ruins. In the aftermath, the site of Bikram Shila was forgotten for centuries until it was rediscovered by the archaeologists in the 19th century. The destruction of Bikram Shila University by Muslim invaders in the 12th century was a significant event in the history of India. Bikram Shila University was one of the major centers of Buddhist learning in ancient India. The university played a vital role in the propagation of education during its heyday. Bhaktiya Khilji's forces are said to have plundered the university and set it on fire. The attack resulted in the destruction of numerous Buddhist scripts and manuscripts. Many Buddhist monks and scholars were killed during the invasion. The destruction of Bikram Shila was part of a larger campaign to suppress Buddhism in India. This marked the decline of Buddhism in India as many Buddhist centers and monasteries were destroyed during this period. Bikram Shila's downfall is often seen as a symbol of the decline of Indian Buddhism. The university's vast library, which housed invaluable manuscripts, was reduced to ashes. The invasion led to a significant loss of knowledge and cultural heritage. Bhaktiyar Khilji's invasion was motivated by religious zeal and a desire to establish Islamic rule. The attack on Bikram Shila was a part of a series of military campaign in northern India. The Pala dynasty which had patronized Buddhism and supported the university was already weakened by this time. The fall of Bikram Shila was a blow to the traditional centers of learning in ancient India. Many Buddhist monks and scholars 
fled to other region such as Tibet to preserve their knowledge. The ruins of Bikram Shila were later discovered by archaeologists and historians. The site has been partially excavated and studied to understand its historical significance. The destruction of Bikram Shila was not an isolated incident. Many other Buddhist institutions suffered a similar fate, like Nalanda. Bakhtiar Khilji's invasion is often criticized for its impact on India's intellectual and cultural heritage. The destruction of Bikram Shila had far-reaching consequences for the study of Buddhism in India. It contributed to the decline of Buddhism in its land of origin. The invasion marked a shift in India's religious landscape towards Islam. The university's demise also impacted trade and cultural exchange in the region. It led to the loss of a significant center for the study of ancient Indian science and arts. The attack on Bikram Shila is a subject to historical debate and research. Some accounts suggest that Bakhtiar Khilji mistook the university for a fort and attacked it. Others argue that the destruction was a deliberate act to suppress non-Muslim learning centers. The invasion was a part of the broader political and religious changes occurring in medieval India. Bikram Shila's destruction is a symbol of the challenges faced by the ancient Indian universities. Some scholars believe that the destruction helped the spread of Islam in India. The attack on Bikram Shila is a continuous and sensitive historical topic. It has been a subject of scholarly research and debate for many years. The destruction of Bikram Shila is a reminder of the complexities of India's historical and cultural evolution. Efforts have been made to preserve and protect the remnants of Bikram Shila. The site has been designated as a protected archaeological site by the Indian government. Bikram Shila's ruins continue to attract scholars, historians and tourists. The downfall of Bikram Shila University is seen as a loss not only for India but also for the global community in search of knowledge.